I can't remember the last time I didn't do that. Like you try before you buy. Like that's just, that's what you do. But I also like the suspense. Like I also like the buildup of like, what's it gonna be like when it finally happens? So like, I don't know, it's, I don't mind either way. I really don't have a preference. I probably wouldn't do it with someone that I actually wanted to date. Like if I'm having sex with you the first time that we're hanging out, it's because I don't really respect you or see a future with you. Like one night stands are like fine, sex is fun, like what are you gonna do? But like why am I gonna go and have drinks with someone that I just wanna fuck when I could just like text them at 2 a.m. or whatever. Some people just have an aura of dateability and some people don't. I mean, I don't think I have an aura of dateability, <laughs> clearly. Ladies. Oh my God. You gotta spit on it. I mean, don't be afraid to fucking just, you know, just fucking hawk a loogie on there. <laughs> it's fine. Like we're all, there's a lot happening. Like there's, there's a lot of fluids oh going on. And uh, with guys, we're so fucking easy to get off that like it doesn't need to be life changing. It can be very, very basic and still get the job done and we'll be happy. Have I gotten like a life changing BJ before? Absolutely. 1000%. But does it require life changing effort to get the, the, the end result? No, it does not. So I'm 23. So good sex is moderately new. As in college, you basically are like a human masturbation sock. Something I wish more guys would implement is the reach around <laughs> because sex is fine. It feels nice, but it's not gonna do anything for me unless I'm getting other stimulation. It's like the reach, you know? It's like you're trying, you're doing something. Is that like if you're bending her over to, to play with the clit while you're fucking well, her? Not just her. bending her over, but yes. Okay. Yes. Got it. In any position, it's pretty possible. Day one shit. Me personally, I'm a big go for a walk guy. You can go for a walk as long as you want. If it sucks, you can be like, hey, like I gotta go. Sorry, like my my You're dog. just gonna leave them wherever you walked them to? Yes, or you call for an Uber and be like, hey, sorry, gotta go. Going for a walk is the same thing as dinner and drinks. You just take the food and alcohol out. Same fucking thing. You're having the same conversation you'd be having. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Like that's like a very, like I'm making a lot of sense over here. I mean, what the fuck is wrong with the walk? I'm crying. <laughs> dinner and drinks like is equivalent to a walk if you take out the dinner and drinks. That's the same thing. So the conversations funny. are exactly the same. How is that any different? Oh my God. I think a walk could work if it's like, let's walk and get ice cream or let's walk and do this. But if you're just aimlessly walking, I'd be like, what are we doing here? I would say no dinner on the first date. I think on a first date, it's strictly drinks. I never wanna be somewhere where I'm two holes deep in a mini golf game and I can't escape. Going to a fun place and getting a drink, great idea for a first date. Oh man. Um, usually it's the mouth, but not in the way That's that you're thinking. Said. It's not even like the smile. It's just like, it's all of it. Like, I don't know. I feel like a mouth can make or break somebody. Like, I feel like you can have like, everything else can be great, but if your mouth is fucked up, it's like, no. I'm a big hands girl, like nice hands. Like, like good nails, like clean, have the nice veins on them, it's hot. I never really worry about what I'm gonna wear on a date because I'm like a firefighter. I'm like, I'm ready to slide down the pole whenever. Like, it, I'm just what always, does that mean? I'm just always ready to go. Like I'm dressed to impress every fucking day. A date could break out at any second. And I'm like, I don't have to go home and change. Like, I'm just like, all right, what's up with this date? I think with guys, as long as you're not wearing like a stained <laughs> t-shirt, you're good. I don't have high expectations for your fashion. I learned that girls really don't give a fuck about where you take them on a first date. Like you don't have to roll out the red carpet. This is exactly what I was saying. Yeah. And it's true. Wow. Um, I, it's true. I and said, wow, I, not no. Oh, I'm learning I said, things. well, and I was like, okay. No. Um, I learned that guys really overthink it. Yeah. And you just don't have to do that. But if it's a girl that you want to like marry, mm. then it's like, guys will overthink that. Well, I guess. It's kind of cute. Mm. Forgot how to walk. They're <laughs> like Ellie. Sorry, I gotta do that again. That. Really have. I'm really sorry. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need to. <laughs> I don't know how to walk.